This device is used for electrolysis of water. We have the two carbon electrodes here and uh, the two tubes are to capture and measure the volume of gases uh, produced. At the bottom here, we have the carbon electrode connected to a metal piece here and another carbon electrode connected to the other metal piece and these metal pieces will then be connected to our battery as the source of power the electrode that is connected to the yellow cable is positively charged because it's connected to the positive terminal of the battery so this is going to be our anode a positively charged electrodes are called anodes because they attract anions and the electrode that's connected to the white cable is negatively charged so we call this our cathode The trick here is to fill the glassware and the tube with sulfuric acid. So I'm going to do that now. Let's start the electrolyte. So this electrode here that's connected to the yellow wire is our cathode. You can see it produces more bubbles than our anode here. Cathode produces hydrogen and anode oxygen is produced there. So actually when we are electrolyzing dilute sulfuric acid, we are electrolyzing or decomposing water to become hydrogen and oxygen. So, using the balanced reaction equation, you can see that there are twice as much hydrogen as compared to oxygen. Okay, you can see now that the volume of gas produced on the cathode is around twice the volume of the gas produced on the end. So this is hydrogen and this is oxygen. <laughs>